Rejoice Ministries. Hallelujah. Let's go into the verse. Ezekiel chapter 37. The hand of the Lord was upon me and he brought me out in the spirit of the Lord and set me down in the middle of the valley. It was full of bones. And he led me around among them and behold, there were very many on the surface of the valley and behold, they were very dry. So here we see that the Lord, the Spirit of God is taking Ezekiel to a valley where there are dry bones. But I think that Ezekiel is the only one who is in the valley of Samabhumi. This Samabhumi is the only one who is in the valley of Samabhumi. In verse 3 he says, Son of man, can these bones live? And I answered, O Lord God, you know. Now, can you answer, can dead bones live again? Oh, but the answer is not the answer. Vyalunu minis katu. Merunu vyalunu minis katu alata nevata panaganvan nata pulu anda. We would all say it's impossible. Api siyalu de nama uttar di medhi, pilitur di medhi kiyavi, ea vennata nupulu anna. And these bones are very dry. There is no chance of life inside them. But the Lord tells Ezekiel, the prophet, prophesy over these bones. Namut Swami Vu Devyan Vahan Se Ezekiel Ta Pavasa Se Tinova Me Vyali Katu Alata Anagata Vakke Vachane Pavasa Anna Kiyal. He tells him to say, O dry bones, hear the word of the Lord. Outa Devyan Vahan Se Anakarana Kiyan Vyali Katu Devyan Vahan Se Ge Vachane Asatva. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. May whatever is dry in your life. Obage Jeevite Vyali La Thiyana it's going to come to life right now. Hallelujah. You may, you may list down the number of dry things in your life. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Are you thinking of the things in your life? Every one of you. Oba hema ke nekmo be jivite vyalila velila tiena deval oba hitanu ada. There is power in the word of the Lord. Swami wo devi anvahan se ke vachane tulla balaya thi benua. Many times we are expected to prophesy over us. Boho avastha valdi apem devi anvahan se balapurutu na api apagena ma anagatava ke pavasai kia. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We have to do this. On ourselves. Api apakarahima me vachana prakashita patkali yutui. If we believe 100% in the power of the word of God. Api siyata siyak devyan vahansa ke vachane tula viswasya tabana ayanam api apatam e vachane prakashita. When you open your mouth and say something in faith, it will happen. Oba, oba gegam khata erala. So please, please have 100% faith in your heart and open your mouth and prophesy. Hallelujah. start doing right now in the course of this message. In Genesis we see the uncreated world was chaotic. Then above uh, the chaos, God's spirit was hovering over. And the Holy Spirit was about to bring life and beauty to the world. We 
when we open our mouth and prophesy over ourselves api ape katawal erala apake rehima divyan wahansege apagena liya thiyena wachane prakashita pat karana kota whatever was chaotic in our life whatever was dry in our life whatever was without life in our life ape jeevithe paalu vela thiyena ape jeevithe vikurthi vela thiyena ape jeevithe anduru vela thiyena deval navata jeevanaya saha pili velata hada gesennata yana hallelujah hallelujah so, lord is wanting to do something today swamin vahanse yam deyak obe jeevithe karannata bala gena sitinawa he has to believe that it's for me හැම කෙනෙක්ම මෙතන පුද්ගලිකව විශ්වාස කරන්න ඕනේ මේ පණිවිඩය මටයි මේ දෙවියන් වහන්සේ කතා කරන්න මගේ ජීවිතේ වෙනසක් මට ඕනාමයි and whatever you want start prophesying over yourself ඔබ ආසා කරන කුමක්ද ආසාව එය ඔබේ කටින්ම ප්‍රකාශයට පත් කරන්න ඔබ ගැන if you can feel the word the power in the word of god ඔබට දැනෙනවද දේව වචනයේ තියෙන බලවත්කම See how sharp it is it's a two edged sword බලන්න දෙවියන් වහන්සේගේ වචනයේ ජීවමානය බලවන්තය දෙමුහත් කඩුවක් කිය It's able to pierce through the soul and the spirit එයට පුළුවන් මේ ආත්මය සහ ප්‍රාණය වෙන් කරන තරමට කාවදින්නට into the joints and the marrow ඒ සන්ධි සහ ඇටමිදුළු හරහ කපන්නට පුළුවන් දේව වචනයට we are going to see the dry bones and here he sits it says of joints and of marrow අපි වියලි කටු ගැන කතා කරේ නමුත් මෙතන හෙබ්‍රේ පුතේ සඳහන් කරනවා සන්ධි සහ ඇටමිදුළු ද අතර කපන්නට මේ දෙමුහත් කඩුවට පුළුවන් ය කියලා and the word of god has power to discern our thoughts and intentions අපේ සිතේ සිතුවිලිද අදහස්ත විමසන්නට දෙවියන් වහන්සේගේ වචනයට බලය තිබෙනවා හැලෙලුයා හැලෙලුයා can these dead bones live again මේ වියලි කටුවලට ආයේ ජීවත් වන්නට පුළුවන්ද now in genesis chapter 2:7 උපති දෙකේ හත දිහා බලමු the lord says he is going to cause breath to enter you and you shall live දෙවියන් වහන්සේගේ වචනයේ කියනවා මම හුස්ම හෙලන්නෙමි නුබලා ජීවත් වන්නේය you see that the storm and the wind is really powerful ඔබට පේන යනවා ඒ සුළඟ සහ කුණාටු ඉතාමත්ම බලවත්ය කියලා in sri lanka you have seen you have experienced the power of storm sri lankawe obala adakala tiyenawa kunaatuwaka tiyana sara how many houses are shattered how many trees are shattered uprooted baha vishala gas perlana taramata me kunaatu balawat vela tiyenawa e wage gewal wala wahala wal galawa gena geniyannata e kunaatuwa balawat vela tiyenawa that is the presence of god jehova ruwa ඒ තමයි දිවියන් වහන්සේගේ අභිමුඛත්වය යෙහෝවා රුවා කියලා the presence of god the energy and the vitality of the holy spirit සුද්ධාත්මනන් වහන්සේගේ බලවත්කම සහ තේජාන් විත භාවය හැලෙලුයා හැලෙලුයා this power which has been given into us මේ බලය අප තුලට යොමු වෙලා තියෙනවා you must believe that this power is within each one of us ඔබ විශ්වාස කරන්න ඕන මේ බලවත් බලවත්කම අප තුල ක්‍රියාත්මක වෙනවා if you believe you have the presence of god within you ඔබ විශ්වාස කරනවා නම් ඔබට දේව අභිමුඛය ඔබ තුල තිබෙන්නට පටන් ගන්න if you believe that you are anointed and you have the holy spirit within in you oba vishwasa karanawa nam oba etokota suddhaatmanan wahanse oba tula weda wahase karannata patan you must also believe that you have this energy and vitality of god within you oba vishwasa karanno na deviyan wahanse ge mahat jeevanaya saha panagen wi me balaya oba tulaya kiyala vishwasa karanno jesus was empowered with the holy spirit yesus wahanse va bale 
ഏൻ പുറവനു ലഹബുവ ശുദ്ധാത്മേൻ വെൻ ഹി വാസ് ബാപ്റ്റൈസ്ഡ് ബൈ ജോൺ ദ ബാപ്റ്റിസ്റ്റ് യോഹാൻ ദ ബൗതിസ്റ്റ് തുലിൻ ഉൻ മഹൻസേ ബൗതിസ്മേ ലഹബുഹാമ ഏ ശുദ്ധാത്മേൻ ഉൻ മഹൻസ പിറ്റട പെമിന ഉൻ മഹൻസേ ബലവത് കർന ലഹബുവ ആൻഡ് വെൻ ജീസസ് ബ്ലൂ ഹിസ് സ്പിരിറ്റ് ഇൻടു ദ ഡിസൈപ്പിൾസ് യേസുസ് വഹൻസേ തമാഗെ ഹുസ്മ ഗോലയാൻ മത ഹെലു അവസ്ഥാവേദി ഏ they became a part of this energy and mm. influence of god's presence me devian mahans ge balavat kame balen own sannad karanu labuwa even when we were born you know when each and every baby is born the presence of god ruwa he blows into the nostrils of babies iting attanama ipadena hamma kuda daruwek tulatama devian mahanse ge husmaya ruwa yom own ge nas puduwalta pimbinu labana he blew into our nostrils and that's why we are living today un mahanse ape nas puduwalta un mahanse ge husma helanu labuwa enisai api jeevat wanne Rejoice Ministries Evangelist Dr. Daphne Joseph Cell 9171100011 Kartadame ungal ovvarayum aasirvaithu kaapaaraaga Amen